Hey there everyone, my name is Nathan and I'm the owner here at Minnesota Mobile Guy. If you're not already familiar with us, we're a business based here in the U.S. state of Minnesota, but we assist customers from all over the world with all sorts of different issues and services on their smartphones, tablets, and other mobile devices. One of the services that our customers most frequently ask us to perform is the removal of the Google Account Security Lock feature on an Android device, also known as the FRP Lock. Now, here with us today, we happen to have a Samsung Galaxy A50 that is originally from Straight Talk or Track Phone here in the U.S. And this is a device that does have the Google Account Lock enabled because as we can see here, as we're going through the setup steps, we get to the screen that tells us that it was reset. And to continue, we have to sign in with the previous Google Google account that was on it. And that's basically what the Google Lock consists of. Google initiated it back in about Android 5 or so to help combat some of the theft and the fraud that happens a lot these days around the buying and selling of used mobile devices. So when an Android device is factory reset without first removing the Google account that's on it, it's then going to ask you to log into that account again as a security measure after the factory reset has been performed. So only the account that was previously on the device will allow you to log in. You can't just log in with any Google account. So we've been contacted by tons of customers over the years asking us to assist them with this specific issue on this exact model, usually either because they themselves accidentally got locked out of their own device and couldn't remember or recover their login information, or because they were sold the device by a dishonest seller who didn't tell them that the lock was enabled, and then obviously after the purchase, the buyer didn't have the login information and the seller had long since disappeared. It's a very common scam that happens these days in regards to the buying and selling of mobile devices, unfortunately. But we're making this video to let any interested customers know that we do offer a service to be able to unlock this device without having to have the previous login information. And it's something that we actually just did right here, right now, while the device was plugged in via the USB cable. So now we should be able to just restart the phone and we should be able to see that we can get all the way through the setup process without seeing that lock. I should mention that this is something that we can do for just about anyone anywhere in the world, so you don't necessarily need to be located here in our local area in order for us to be able to do this for you. You would just need to have a decently powerful Windows computer along with a fast internet connection, and we can remotely connect directly to your computer right through the internet and perform the exact same procedure that we just did right here. So the phone's just finishing booting up here, and then like I said, we'll just start going through all the steps one at a time and we should be able to see that we can indeed get all the way through the setup process this time so we're going to tap that arrow and start we have to agree to the terms and conditions and then we come to wi-fi we actually don't need that so we're just going to go ahead and skip it and then we're not going to copy any apps or data Google services can be skipped, and we don't need a screen lock, so we're going to skip that too. We don't need any other apps. We're just going to bypass that part, and we don't need a Samsung account. I think we should be just about there. We've got one last screen there with some stuff from TrackPhone that they want to put on there. We're just going to say no, and I think, yep, we're all set here. So we see the home screen loading up here. We have full access now to all of the apps and settings and features. And this is just like a brand new device that never had the lock on there. While I'm here, I'm going to go ahead and jump into the settings just to show you exactly what we're working with. So under About Phone, we can indeed see that we have a Galaxy A50. And then that model number there, the S506DL, that's what uniquely identifies it as the A50 from Track Phone or Straight Talk. So, if you have one of these Galaxy A50s and need help getting the Google Lock removed from it, we would love to help you out with that, so go ahead and get in touch with us. All of our contact information will be right down in the video description, and I'll also put a slide at the end of the video here that has all of the info there as well. Make sure to check out some of the other videos that we have here on our channel, as we offer a lot of different services for a lot of different devices, and I'm sure you'll find something there that could come in handy. Make sure to hit that subscribe button while you're there also to be notified of all the new videos and services that we're constantly adding and putting up, just like this one. Y para todos ustedes hispanohablantes, nosotros también hablamos español, así que ustedes nos pueden contactar sin duda. Thanks for watching, everyone, and have a great day.